Hey, what's good, YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. In this one, we're taking the Void Warlock into the Trials of Osiris, and I'm going to be showcasing my best Trials build. Here, I'm going to quickly showcase what I'm using so you have an idea of what kind of gameplay you're looking at. And at the end of the video, I'll do an in depth look at my whole build Hawk Moon, Matador with Threat Detector opening shot, Blaspa 2. We have the Child of Gods and the Chaos Accelerant Aspects, Remnants, Leeching, and Dilation. We're using the Ophidian Aspect. Enjoy the gameplay. Only one enemy is left. Man, Ophidians are so crispy, dude. You've been living the good life with this exotic, bro. <laughs> oh, dude. Last season, it was perfect. No. Maybe the scout rifle could help a little bit. It's void, so people like that for volatile and the uh, rapid fire frame too for PVE. Come on, brother, move. Vaping. Give me tag one. He's weak. You need like six hits for the perk. Only one enemy is left. I'm really trash with glaives though. Me too. I haven't even made a video on them. <laughs> yeah, I'd rather use a fusion. Not everything's meant for everybody, I guess. Only one enemy is left. The match that was cool. Is yours. I will join you. Ladies and gentlemen, before we dive into the video, I want to make an announcement that we are upgrading from the regular Frostbolt Shaker too. An ice shaker the quality on these things is amazing and we have one with my logo they're going to be limited edition in blue and black if you get yourself one you're going to have the first edition up in front now whenever these are sold out we are not going to sell the same design if you're interested check the link down below and then let's get into the gameplay i got clap by an end Fuck. I chose to put out the wrong gun. I had that. Yeah, I feel like they nerf abilities, but I see more grenades this season. Me too. I had literally so many action bolts on my Titan. Ah, oh, rift. What is this guy looking at? Only one enemy is left. He'd overcharge accent bolts. <laughs> are sick. You have to shoot it like two to three times with a hand cannon. When they charge it? Mm hmm. Oh, shit. I don't think this map is a good idea for this meta. Oh, he put the SMG. The booty SMG. You don't like it? No. The travel time is just ass. Only one oh, steady in its cracks. I am surprised I'm not seeing any of the exotic SMGs. It's like aimbot. So I thought I would see a lot of them. I don't see any multimax either. Mm. Multimax invis? Ooh. All I saw in quick play is fucking ace of spades or pally, fade bearer, and yeah. shot. Dude, they're going for us. Like, for what, so man? Crazy. Oh, maniac. Only one ally is left. Is it dead? No, oh, no, no, no. One minute left, my friend. You are back in the fight. Only one enemy is left. Good job. And this, this is the game. Burn it. Next match. You guys got lucky in the raid, bro. What do you mean? <laughs> you didn't get error coded. We did at, at the start. Once. I think it was twice, actually. One minute left. We got error coded 30 times. I'm not even exaggerating. Okay, 30? It was like a race between you and our team, and 
You went yes. past us like for five yeah. hours. I was like, fuck. No 30 way. arrow codes? Yeah. They, they got Dune. Nice. Round one. Oh, yeah. Holy abilities. Opponents have been putting them play. Good job. Is it one of your top three raids or no? Top three, probably not. Here uh, we go. And you have won it all. I think it is for me. Crota is first for me because it's like straight to the point and like fast. Yeah. Guardian down. Uh Oryx is definitely out there. It's probably number three. Gotcha. Not last push, it was too long. Nah, it's too much mechanics and shit. Gotcha. The match is yours. For me, it's uh, Taking King, Last Wish, and then this one, the newest one, Disciple. I love I the fucking the story and the lore. A little bit, though. But it's like good, but. Nothing not crazy about it. I don't really care about the origin trait perk, to be honest. Not a PvE. See, the origin, should, they should have a PvE side and a PvP side. Yeah, that'd be if sick. If it's double PvE, like, this, no one cares. That one's right. Cubby, Cubby's weak. Two on my side. There's one, one super one shot. They're both weak. Fucking shades that jumped over my bullets. It is no one left. Your team is in the lead, Guardian. Do not relent. an axe and bolt soon. I have to not be able to pop that Dude, quickly. Dude, this guy's annoying. You are the last. Make them run from lane. Thirty seconds left. Let's go. Enemy team has fallen. You suck them. Oh my god. <laughs> Help, I'm tethered. Oh my god. Dude, that was so funny. I did the melee and the sent them flying to the sky with this tether. <laughs> Oh, that's why I was in the air. Yeah. <laughs> that was that funny. Is inconsistent, though, it's it's really bad. I think it's pretty poor. It doesn't poor. like push all the time. I think it's a fair trade-off though. It has crazy aimbot to it. Yeah. Traded. One v one. Let's go, teammate. Surprised he won that. The guy had an SMG too. It's cool that he moves around and does shit, you know? Yeah, the fucking kicks are funny. Trade. Holy melee. Time behind the shield. These overcharged accent bolts are so lethal, man. If you're not playing with the overcharged accent bolts, I don't know what to tell you, man. Do yourself a favor and rock those if you really want to be a strong Void 3.0 Warlock. Only one enemy 
is left. Guardian down. <gasps> Only one ally is Ow. left. It is in their hands. Might have missed or Your potentially just down. didn't have Icarus have the actual good air accuracy right there. So close, I wanted it. Nice. Both hurt. They're gonna ape. <laughs> okay. I wanted the same thing. Round is yours. Good fight. Three tag, three tag. <laughs> and three. This is the game. Very good. Axe and bolts. Guardian down. Give me that one. We got a wish show. Guardian against Guardian. Go down. One minute left, my res in your bag. Good call. Your He's gonna get a revive right back. in front of us. Opponent my eight. Revive. Oh, they got two? Wait, where's my shotty? Ah, uh, didn't even one shot. Left. Great. Whoa, this guy's fucking aggressive. The next round oh, it's because I die, so I spawn with zero shots. Great. This one left side already aiming. Full strike for one shot. Nice. One left again. Trying to get that galley. Get that res, buddy. I'm gonna. Oh. Got one. Only one enemy is left. What the hell? How is he just sitting up there? There's no way I didn't hear it. One minute left, my friend. Only one enemy is left. That was you. All you. This round is yours. Holy nades. <laughs> Getting my res. Your ally is back in the fight. Opponent revived. That's gonna get it too. So weak. One minute left, my friend. I'm gonna ask you. Ah. Only one enemy is left. Nice. Yes. And three. This is the game. Very good. Yeah, the little sentient thing actually got me a kill. Guardian down. Fuck, it's the same team? Is this? Yep. Your ally is back in the fight. Only one enemy is left. <laughs> they tried very hard to kill you, but you are like me, very stubborn. <laughs> oh no. And I always have abilities at the start of every round. Only one enemy is left. The Warlock melee might not do a lot of damage, Good but job. there's still some benefits to it. You throw off the enemy team. Now we get a little Your bit of chip damage. Oh wow. Only one enemy is left. <laughs> My axe and bolt, dude, it's so fast. They should have known better than My axe and bolt is a combination of a stompy man. hunter with top tree dawn blade Icarus dash. <laughs> Even if you die, you don't, because that axe and bolt is going to be seeking revenge. Nice kill. One minute left, my friend. Oh. Only one ally and that is, is flawless. The match is yours. Celebrate. On to the lit house. 
Let's see if we get a god roll summoner. Overflow Focus Fury, does that stack? I have Overflow Multi Kill Clip as well. Which I don't think really works. Got a red summoner. Can't craft it though. Go. Take them. I hope you enjoyed watching the gameplay. Let's take a more in-depth look at my build. When it comes to weapons, it's all personal preference. I'm using the Hawk one because I like it, Matador, and Blast II. I want to talk about the exotic choice for this build. Uh, one exotic that I think is the best on Warlocks and probably one of the better ones overall in the whole game, which is called Ophidian Aspect. This says weapons ready and reload very quickly. Melee range is extended. So the weapons ready basically gives you faster handling on your guns. And this paired with aggressive frames like for Winter's Lie is a really strong combination. I'm still going to use Matador. Now the melee range is going to be nice for the neutral play. And I'm using Grenade Kickstart, which says your grenade energy is fully expended. You gain grenade energy. This takes me to the next point, which is my subclass and my grenade option, which is Axiom Bolt. So Axiom Bolt this season have been really strong, but even better on a Void Walker because of an aspect called Chaos Accelerant. You can overcharge your grenade and it makes it deadlier and more effective. So Axiom Bolt here says that it creates an additional seeker and you may be thinking that that's really it. It doesn't do anything else. But in reality, what this does is that the action bolt becomes faster, so it's harder to avoid. And not only that, but the action bolt itself also has more HP, so that it means that the opponents are going to require more shots to destroy the action bolt. And let me tell you, <laughs> it is very difficult to shut this thing down and just waste all your ammo on it. It gives you an opportunity to push that opponent when they're busy with action bolts. So that's one thing to consider. Very deadly. We have Child of Gods. You know, this is pretty self-explanatory. It's one of the better aspects. I do not uh, think Devour is really the play here. For the Fragments, we have Remnants. So that Axiom Bolt chases for longer durations and it doesn't just kind of, you know, lose its tracking after a couple seconds. The Health Region on Melee Kills, it's a nice pair with Ophidian Aspect considering they have the bonus melee range. So, the last here we have Echo of Dilation. While Crouch is sneak faster and gain Enhanced Radar. So I like that because of the neutral play. Now let's take a look at the rest of the mods on my build. We have shotgun targeting and high energy fire. Due to the fact that I'm using a fitting aspect and have really good stats on my armor, I have a lot of free spots to use different types of mods. I'm using radiant light for the bonus strength and unflinching hand cannon because I love pairing that with the hand cannon. Next up we have powerful friends for the bonus mobility and hand cannon holster because I do not want to use shotgun scavenger I do not feel like I need it. We have double bomber so that we can get our grenades back faster whenever I pop a rift. That, in combination with Grenade Kickstart, 100 Discipline is going to give me so many Axiom Bolts and you are going to be a nightmare to play against if you're using Void Lock 3.0. Those Axiom Bolts are really strong, especially inside of Charles of Osiris. It's like having extra teammates. Now, to finalize this outro, let's take a look at the stats. 60 Mobility, 42 Strength, 100 Recovery is very required, especially because it ties into your Rift. 100 Discipline is going to give me so many Axe and Bolts, 50 Intellect, and 72 Strength. Thank you so much, and I'll see you on the next one for The Hunter. Peace.